how to boot your LG L3 phone. Now sometimes you need to um, install some apps, or you have to if you want to or if you want to do some advanced uh, functions on your phone, you will need to boot your device. So you have uh, so that you can have full access to the device. Now to do so, uh, first you need to um, perform a few steps. So to do um, to boot your phone, uh, first tap on the apps icon at the bottom. Go to settings, then tap on applications. Scroll all the way to the bottom. Tap on development. Then first enable USB debugging. So make sure the USB debugging is enabled. Next, you need to connect the phone to the computer. So using the USB cable and simply just plug it to the device. Okay. After you have installed, the, after you have connected your device to the computer, you will need to install the drivers. So if you go to my computer, manage. If you go into device manager here, and then you can see here it's a my LG Android phone drivers is not available. So that means we have to install it. So say the drivers for this device are not installed, so we need to install the drivers. Now I have included a link in the description of this video so that you can download the drivers. So just run that. And this will try to install the drivers for your LG phone. So just select the appropriate language and click on next. So you can see here it's the LG United Mobile Drivers. So just click on next. Okay, you can see here it says installing device driver uh -huh. software. So we'll probably try to install the drivers for your for the LG device. You can click on it. So you can see here it's installing. So just wait for that to finish. Driver installed successfully. So just click on OK. So we just click on the close button. And if we go back to my computer, manage. Click on device manager. And now you can see um, all the other one is already installed. So it's the only one left is this one here. It's up. Uh, next, you need to um, uh, download this uh, tool here, boot tool. So once you have downloaded, then you can uh, unzip the file. And once you go into here, you can uh, right click on that file there. And uh, just actually you can just uh, double click on that file to run the files. So, so here, um, just press any key to continue. So we do that. So you should see the device is rebooting right now. During this time, you should see your device rebooting quite a couple of times. Now, once your device has been rebooted, you can check to confirm this by uh, going to the application list. Then, uh, from here, just scroll down the list and look for the app called Super User. So this app here basically meaning that you uh, your phone has been successfully booted. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more video tutorials.